welcome, welcome back to another episode here on the Existence SMP server. My name is Dashlub, and today we are finally starting our base. I hear my coordinates, uh, negative 363 and positive 936. And I just wanted to kind of find a forest biome in between last episode and this episode. I just went pretty much straight one direction from spawn, I think south. I don't know exactly. Um... But I've got some obsidian and flint and steel, so I make a portal to run back. But I'm pretty sure it spawns just that way, or or that way, one of the two. Um, <laughs> anyways, uh, I think it's about time that we finally start our base. Um, so today I was thinking we would do kind of an entrance. I I've talked a little bit about what I want to have for my base, uh, but we can talk more about it right now. Um, I want to have a mining area, kind of like Brayden's. Uh, me and Brayden are going to be having kind of a little friendly competition of who, of just uh, like an underground base, essentially. We're both going to have underground bases, different themes and stuff. Um, I don't want to talk too much about his because his episode hasn't released yet of um, him starting it, I believe so. Or it, it may by the time uh, that this is out, but as of now, of the recording, his episode has not been released. So I'm not going to talk too much about it, but it is an underground base. And I'm going to be doing an underground base as well. And we are going to be going for a dwarven theme. So we're going to have like a lot of lava columns pouring down and fire lighting and stuff like that. We'll may include some grass and shrubbery, but it's mainly going to be old dwarven. Uh, we may even get like some old like mechanical gears, like a old mining colony underground. Uh, but today I thought I would make a big entrance built in the side of this nice hill and it will have a staircase going down uh down into the the mountain um so yeah uh but i chose a forest biome because i just really like the color of the grass um in default minecraft so when other people come here if i do end up using grass and foliage um it'll be a nice vibrant green for everyone and not just us because we do have the edited uh textures as uh, many of y'all might know just from looking at these which i'm going to take out um but i'm not sure how much work i'm really going to be doing today uh, i know i want to get the main entrance and then start on a staircase down i don't know if i'm going to be doing a lot of terraforming out here eventually i know that i do want to do some terraforming out here and maybe plop some other things uh out here like some uh small mining refinement or stuff like that i'm uh, not really sure yet um but i know that i want to definitely do this entrance so i'm going to work some stuff out uh, do a little bit of progress kind of do some measurements maybe build a little bit in creative in a test world and then i'll come back once i've got a better idea of what exactly i want this to look like all right let's turn and look i've been doing a little bit of work here over on our new base uh just getting down kind of heights and a, a general block shape i want to kind of stick with whenever we use stone brick makes it with andesite whenever we use stone makes it with andesite uh or polished and then non-polished um and i really like it and i even added some little coal bits in here i don't know if any of this is going to stay because i had an envision of like another building here maybe for the nether portal or for something else i'm not sure um <clears throat> but for now this looks really nice and y'all have already seen me do a lot of terraforming so i'm going to finish up the terraforming um, and then probably just keep doing a little bit of work around here. Um, I probably won't do all of this terraforming around here or like pathways or any of that yet. Uh, but I will definitely work on this, this range, uh, a bit today. So yeah, I'm going to get back to work. All right, guys. And I have done quite a bit of work on the towers here. Uh, definitely not done yet, but definitely a lot closer. I should not have taken out those dirt blocks yet, but we can... Uh, go ahead and give you a little bit of a progress update let me grab these already on my hotbar and we'll do those and that's the front pretty much done i believe okay now let's see how these babies are looking uh there they are yeah this one is done for the most part on this side what's well, completely done on this side still got to do a little bit on this side and I've spaced them out a little bit more than I originally planned because I want to have a large gateway here uh, with another addition to this. I haven't designed it yet, but I want another addition to this to come out kind of on top and connect them with the gateway underneath it and like an archway. 
Um, but yeah, I think they're looking super, super awesome. Super kind of almost like evilly, but definitely dwarven with this, uh, this kind of shape that I've made. Uh, so yeah, really, really like it. Uh, I'm going to finish this up. I got a little bit of terraforming to do on this side uh, to shape that in to the back so I don't have to do the back. And as well as on that side. Uh, but Sandman is sleeping, so we're skipping the night away. But yeah, I'm going to get back to work and uh, finish these towers up. And we're all done. There they are from the front. Uh, now I have got to make an archway. I think I'm going to come off from this middle part. Instead of going with this, I'm going to arch it a bit more and loop it up with that one. And then it will recess back and back and back. And then we will have a gate, a large gate. And I'll use like spruce trap doors because they look like a big door. And I'll have it like slid open. Uh, but I still got to come up with the design for that. So let me slide over here real quick and show you what I did. I did just a little bit of terraforming right here. Uh, edging this into the terrain. And then it, it's a pretty large hill. So it builds up, pretty much covers up all the back. And same over here. Just like so. So yeah, um, not really going to have a place inside these. They're so small on the inside because of the lava. It's just literally a one block hole. So yeah, um, don't really need to do anything for the inside there. So yeah. Uh, anyways, guys, I'm going to try and figure out a design for this archway and this extra bit on top. We may not get completely done with this entrance today, but I would really like to. Uh, and then I will be back. And there's a basic archway. Uh... I, I like the shape. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this at all. I don't know if it. I'm going to wait. Uh, or not wait. I don't know if I want it to start back there. Or if I want it to start up here on these towers. I feel like that'll look weird and the tower should be in front a little bit. But I also don't know. Uh, I really think I should jump into a creative world and build this. Uh, but I haven't. And the only thing I've built in creative is just the design of the, the tower. Um, so I'm really playing it by ear. But... Yeah, so that's why we're not doing much building on camera because I can't, it's hard for me or difficult for me to come up with designs and stuff on camera for the first time. I can replicate one on camera uh, decently, but it's hard for me to build from scratch uh, for the first time on camera. So that's why most of this episode and uh, most of my episodes nowadays are more clip oriented of me just showing you what I've done because... I've just been doing things in survival mode a lot. Um, but yeah, uh, so I'm going to try and keep going how I've been going. Maybe I'll do a little bit of designing and creative. Maybe not. But yeah, this is what we're looking at right now. And I quite like it. And there's some wireframe for the part above. I can go on up here and show you what I've done, mainly on that side. So you can't really see it. I got a little bit carried away. could definitely say that. Uh, and I've kind of worked out how I want the landscaping down below to be. But we're definitely going to have to do that another time. Because this episode is running pretty late on how long it's taken me to record. I don't even know how long it actually is in, in actual like video length. Because I haven't gotten to editing. But I know it's been about like a week and a half since the Ender Dragon fight. So Or since the Ender Dragon fight video. Um as of me recording this clip so uh yeah i definitely need to finish this up soon so i'm gonna duplicate this to the other side and kind of just fill this in with some designs that they may not be permanent uh i'm not sure yet i want to get some lava worked in there somehow i got lava down in here on this side i'm gonna do the same over there i want to get some lava up in the front as well uh not flowing out but just a design in the wall with lava so yeah, I'm going to keep working, and hopefully next time I come back, this will be done. <laughs> Alright, it should be all done now. I haven't done the back, and I'm not going to do the back for a while, and whenever I do, it's probably just going to be plain flat stone, because it's never going to be seen. But here's what it's looking like. <laughs> it's all finished up on the front. I really like it. I still have to do the gate and landscaping out here, but I think I'm going to save that for next episode, and then maybe we can work on the inside just a little bit next episode as well. Um, but yeah, I really enjoy making this. I think it's going to be an awesome entrance to our base. And these little blocks right here are how I want uh, our path to be. If we come out straight and just beeline it, you're not going to really get a good shot. I mean, that's a really cool shot right there. And I'm going to take a screenshot of that. But if we force the player, uh, we're going to have to find something to put right here. Because if we force the player this way, 
around and then you and then and we block their vision here for a bit and then we can have a big reveal like right about here when they come around and that's an awesome screenshot as well so i'm gonna grab this as well so yeah really enjoyed making this uh, i hope you guys have enjoyed it as well uh, if you really enjoyed it please hit the like button and feel free to subscribe if you want to see more content like this i'm hopefully going to be having a single player episode up next um or after the next episode of existence but yeah anyways guys my name is dash and as always thanks for watching